Hey, Jim Parr here from JimParr.com. We teach you things how to make money on online with digital marketing and different tools like blogging and everything else. Today, we're going to talk to you about how to verify your Shopify store in your Google Search Console. Also, there's some other things that you might need it for, um, like verifying a Google Merchant Center, st stuff like that. So um, we're going to go into the, the part with the Google Search Console. But before we get going, I want to uh, go in and add this property. So we don't have this particular domain into our website. So we're just going to go in and add the domain in here. So as we go in here, we're just going to paste in the domain. It's going to ask to verify the property. And to verify the property, typically that's putting an HTML tag into the website. So we're going to do that. We're going to let this verify. It'll take just a uh, less than a minute to do this. So let's let that happen. So here we are. We can do a couple of different verifications. Uh, you can download HTML file. Um, what we always do is add a tag. So if we just go down here and we copy and paste this, uh, basically, you're just going to do a control C and go over to uh, your Shopify. And to find where you need to go, you need to go into online stores. So we're going to go into online store and we're going to look for actions here. And we're going to edit the code. And it's going to open up basically an HTML editor. And we want to look for this theme.liquid because that's your home page. And then you're going to put it into the header. So we want to find the head. So here's the head right here. That's the bottom of the head. And there should be one without this little uh, forward slash, meaning the beginning of the head but we can put it anywhere in the head is what we want to do. So we're going to paste that in and we're going to save that. So now we're going to go back to our uh, Google Webmaster Tools and we're going to click Verify. And you can see Ownership Verified. The tag was put in, so it was successfully done. So we just hit Done or Go to Property. If we go to property, we can see that it's in there and we're good to go. So it's easy as that to add that in there. And you can do the same with Google Merchant. Uh, Google Merchant will ask, uh, or Merchant Center will ask for a verification. You can do the same thing, grab that tag, drop it into your Shopify, and it's as easy as pie. So. Uh, if you have any questions, comments, uh, leave them below. Also, remember to subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell notification. I do a lot of money videos, ways to make money in an easy $10,000 a month online every single month. So I appreciate you watching. If you want to check out what I have to offer to put you in di the digital marketing space like I do and make over 50 k a month, uh, just go to Jim Parr, that's J I M P A A R dot com forward slash JP, and you'll get a free product there. Plus, you can set up a strategy call or purchase my product. So, the other one is Jim Parr dot com forward slash stealth. Thanks for watching.